Where are we today, Kyle? Um, Crackstones, which is uh, not far from Slaveburn, and there's loads of different areas, I think. Well, watch out for that puddle. Like, uh, 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 what's this place? Cow stones, bull stones, yeah. big stones, little stones, I don't know. There's bull lots stones. of stones. Yeah. Should be good. So we'll see you up there. I'm pretty sweaty. 48 minutes walking. Cow's <laughs> done. Cow's trailing. He's done. <laughs> not been doing his cardio work. I'm not gonna lie, I thought this was gonna be a 40 minute walk. Last. Starting to worry we won't even find any boulders now. It's a long what 4k in? Yeah, it's not like that. that. Luke's done his 5k run. Had to run back and shut the gate. Cheers for that. Still not the boulders yet. That looks like boulders over there. We can finally see some rocks. Got the boys in convoy. Heading up there. We're talking about rolling ankles. It's uh, no path up here, so we've gone cross country. What are you saying, boys? So, an hour approach. Finally arrived at some grit stone. What, what section is this? Uh, cow stones. Cow stones. Yeah. How are you feeling, Kyle? <laughs> approach. Talk to me about that approach. Biggest approach. We've done. Yeah, it's biggest today, isn't it? Yeah. Well, you can see it like all the way down there. Is it not a path? And that's just like a little like hill. That end. Very nice day. Hopefully, the sun will come out. I'm going up there. I want stuff up there. Oh, up we go. go. <laughs> no, Van's approach shoes really doing me well here. Yeah. How are your Van's approach shoes? <laughs> right, we're here. Time to get a boulder in. Let's get to it.
bro. Oh, oh, I got scared. <laughs> you had that then. <laughs> This felt like. Yeah. Do you know, like trusting your tower on that. Yeah. Like you sort of send, send some harder problems, and then you really struggle with like a something really simple. I forgot, I forgot this pain. Different kind of problem though, slab in it. Yeah, it is. Everyone has different specialities and things we find hard. The only thing is, I quite like slabs. This is now. Yeah, like it's something you need to push through. Come on. Come on, right foot, right foot, right foot, go, 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 oh! You nearly had it, bro. Come on, really trust, stepping through onto that right foot and you've got this. Come on, yes. That's it, that's it. Oh, so close. It's just a mental barrier, just forget it all. Come on. That it's done. Come on. Yes. Thank God for that. <laughs> How many tries will I have? Which is like, oh, now it's weird, isn't it? This one like, yeah. And he's right foot instead of going here. Dimple, you just put it onto there straight up. Well done, mate. That was a battle. I'm not gonna lie, coming here is a great day out, but it's definitely a full day out. The yeah. approach times are minimum an hour. It's like a minimum an hour to the first bouldering spot, but like it's a long way between spots and it's pretty hard. There's no like really clear paths. You kind of like cross country and um, it's quite exposed up here. So it's a really nice hot day today, but it's still pretty breezy. Yeah. We're just chilling, aren't we? Chilling. It's a sit start, maybe it does. <laughs> Next time, I think we go to the east side. The yeah, high up first is the tip. Let's go to the highest point of the of the fell, climb there and then work our way down because going so bottom up. Well, yeah, we're also oh, thinking we want to get back all the way over there but to get there we're going to have to walk all the way back over to where you probably can't see them on the camera but there's a little path that goes all the way along there where them people are on them bikes and we've got to follow that all, all the way over there for an hour and a half. I think it is home time soon, isn't it? Toe knuckles have taken absolute battering. Hands bleeding. Well, I mean, knee. It's hardly like. I've got a little knee one as well. Ooh, we can Look be at that. Look, at, look at that guy. He's <laughs> poking out. Alright, mate. I think we'll uh, pack them again off soon. I'll give this a whirl, but yeah. it doesn't look. I don't like them when they're like this with a like <laughs> steep drop down the valley. Mins rolling. Down. If you've ever seen Italian job, the original, that the one ending. Looks quite good there. Yeah. But absolutely slippery. Isn't it? Hurting bad. Right, living whatever I do, you always do anyway. So we know what's going to happen now. There we go. <laughs> 
halfway. But a nice right foot there. Please yeah. spot him. Max just said if I was to have fallen down there, he would have called 111. <laughs> That's a little just to worrying. Get some advice. <laughs> Yes. Tell everyone what just happened, Matt. Well, the shoe tells its own story. That is <laughs> from sole to here is soaking wet. Yeah, there's a little brook Sneaky. hidden away, just hidden away. Kyle's had a disappearing yeah. foot as well. Probably one to be wary of on this little walk. Van's probably not the greatest approach shoes. No. Um, maybe well, waders. I was singing Hoffman's praises, like, you know, approach you with a century, but what can you do when there's like mini caves underneath the grass? I'll watch this death drop. So we have just come from up there all the way down here. 20 minutes. We were contemplating the Death Valley traverse, but opted for the sensible option. Yeah, what would you rate this place, Kyle? Uh, climbing. Yep. 7 out of 5. 7.5 out of 10. 7.5 out of 10, Matt. I mean, agree 7.5 out of 10. I mean, the problem being that because I've not climbed for so long, my skin just evaporated after yeah. like the first yeah, one. Yeah, so that, that grits don't get I you bad. I might well have rated it higher had I been able to climb for longer. I'm going to also agree with a 7.5. The fun problems, loads of different grades, and like we probably didn't even touch the amount of problems, so there's loads more to come back for if we can ever be arse trekking for two hours. I think Basically. the problem is that I compare it to Thorncrag, and Thorncrag has yeah, everything good. within a yeah. short walk from the fire road. So like, it's still the same sort of 45 minutes to get up, but you're sort of straight onto problems then, and there's some really big, epic ones there. Watch out, we've got a monster puddle. <laughs> so you yeah, can go upstairs too. but not down them? Yeah. Oh.